Steve, how would you describe uh, these presentations uh, this morning? Well, um, so far, um, everyone seems, I've heard this morning, in, in this morning's presentations, which have been so far, uh, Bohegan Sun uh, at the Concord, uh, the Green Street Project for uh, Stewart Airport, uh, the uh, Hudson Valley Casino and Resort in uh, uh, the town of Newburgh, and now is uh, the Neville Project <clears throat> outside of Ellenville. And if there's one theme emerging, I think I think it's that everyone seems to acknowledge that the Catskills is going to get one casino. Um, uh, people talk about the need uh, constantly of the Catskills, even. Even uh, the, the uh, Newburgh project, the Hudson Valley Casino project, even those folks seem to acknowledge that, uh, yes, uh, we know Sullivan County or maybe is going to get one, but we wouldn't hurt it. So that's a theme that seems to be emerging uh, so far. Um, Steve, um, in terms of uh, attendance there, are these all, all of these presentations very well attended? Um, you know, to be honest with you, it's, it's hard to tell. There are probably a couple hundred people here at any given time, but uh, so many of the um, presentations come with teams of uh, people um, that, uh, for instance, the Mohegan Sun team brought a couple dozen people, they're all gone. And people are running in and out and talking outside and, and things like that. But I'd say it's probably a couple hundred people uh, in a room full of, with a capacity of about 400. Is there a theme to some of the questions that the board members might be asking, uh, Steve? Um, the, the board members, they seem to be concentrating on financing um, for the projects that, that haven't named uh, the financiers, financiers yet. They also seem to be focusing on the impact of the larger Orange County casinos which haven't yet to present yet um, on some of the projects. Um, that seems to be a uh, thing. I should also note that, uh, Tracy, that in the crowd, Sullivan County is by far the best represented. There are officials here from uh, Scott Samuelson, the legislature chairman, to a few legislators. Darlene Sedan, CEO of Bethel Woods, is here. The president of SUNY Sullivan is here. Uh, so that's one thing. Steve Newhouse is here from Orange, Judy Kennedy, uh, Newburgh Mayor, but also showed up to lend their support. Can you describe what these presentations look like? Is, a, is there a lot of uh, flash and uh, uh, video and, uh, you know, real dog and pony shows here? Well, um, no, no, uh, no cheerleaders yet, <laughs> although uh, the folks from Montrain which is uh, the Empire Resort EPR properties uh, proposal uh, at the Concord. Uh, there are a bunch of those folks walking around in white t-shirts uh, saying, I'm on train, we're ready now. Uh, but they're, they're all pretty much a mix of videos and spoken word. Um, the Mohegan Sun at the Concord and now the uh, Neville uh, project. They both speak of the dire need of the Catskills, how great uh, the area was when all these hotels and resorts were there, and how these uh, the current casinos could revitalize them. Um, and, and one final thing, um, Steve, has the board at the beginning of, of, of this uh, day or at any point uh, tip their hand in terms of when they make reach uh, decisions about these casino licenses? Uh, no, they haven't tipped their hand at all. I will say though that it, I, you know, if I were a betting man, and I'm not, uh, it sure seems as if they are leaning toward me fulfilling um, the goals of the Upstate Development Act which created uh, the law that allows the two casinos. And uh, that need would seem to be focused on depressed areas like uh, Sullivan County and now uh, the Ellenville area of um, uh, Ulster and, um, and also the, the, the focus
folks in Newburgh uh, really hammered that. The, the folks in the Hudson Valley uh, Resort, which would be in the town of Newburgh, really hammered that point home, how much they need a casino. All right, Steve, thank you. Interesting stuff. Uh, look forward to hearing from you in the future. Thanks, Steve. Okay, back to the presentation. Thanks, Tracy.